Welcome to the Dear Doc Podcast, where we will discuss the business of running a dental practice with a panel of experts. Now, your host, Dr. Christopher Hoffpower. Before we get into the show and introduce today's guest, I would just like to thank United Medical Credit for being sponsors of this podcast and of the Business of Dentistry. As a matter of fact, they have a special offer for Business of Dentistry members, 0% merchant fees for the rest of the year, and 30% discount for life after that. You can get that special deal by either going to DocOffInvestments.com and clicking on the deal section, or by going directly to www.unitedmedicalcredit.com forward slash TBOD. Thanks again, UMC. Hey guys, thank you for uh, joining us here on the Dear Doc Podcast. This is Dr. Christopher Huffpower, your host, coming to you from my studio here in Alvin, Texas. Today, I'd like to introduce you guys to a, a company that I didn't know about, um, but I recently chatted with, and they have offered some amazing discounts and deals for our group. Uh, so with no further ado, Omar, can you introduce Hi. us to Pure Life? Hi, everybody. My name is uh, Omar Almidani. I'm one of the co-founders of Pure Life. Um, maybe you haven't heard from us. We are about 12-year-old company. And in dental, that's extremely young. I think the average age for a, a dental dealer is maybe 200 years or something like that. So, um, or 150. Uh, but we, we we came to the scene wanting to uh, try to make an impact, trying to make a difference. Uh, uh, that starts with being fully uh, socially and environmentally responsible. Everything that we carry is uh, carbon offset. We have a big focus on uh, eco-friendly products. Every product that has our name on it, we have tweaked the manufacturing to some extent um for it to be better so some in some cases it's a small deal like just better recyclable materials and some in some cases a big deal we've actually changed the chemistries um and without altering the performance in, in fact in cases in some cases we have boosted the performance um and um yeah so that's what we stand for we're trying to make dentistry better and this has evolved from eco to focusing more on health and more recently in the last five years we're all into tech and so maybe we can talk about that, but we've uh, developed a lot of tools that uh, streamline the process for you guys, automate a lot of the stuff that are repetitive and, and uh, you know, um, what's the word here? Uh, uh, when you grind, <laughs> uh, tiresome, um, save you time, save you money, help you focus on your patients. And frankly, in many cases, uncover savings that you didn't even know were available. And we can talk about that later, but we're all about saving you money, time um, and helping you make an environmental impact at the same time. So you, you've got a lot that we've got there that we can unpack. Um, I do want to say that uh, in our initial conversation, whenever you got to automation, you really, you really rang my bell because that's a, a thing I really believe in. I know we had a very long discourse about that, but one of the other things that I thought was of note is the business of dentistry is one of the few places that is a, a dental group that's not specifically for biological dentists or even dentists who just have a, a real environmental interest where they can actually exist without getting beat up on uh, because we don't allow that kind of negativity here. Um, so I was really excited to hear about a lot of your environmentally friendly um, aspects of your business, as, as well as some of the other things that we're going to get into that we can discuss that I think will be a really great fit for a lot of our, our members who are biological dentists or even just people who really care about the environment. So I guess where we should first start is let's unpack how you got into dentistry um, and, and how you started this company 12 years ago. What did that journey look like? Yeah, that's, uh, I'm going to try to compress what I usually ramble for hours into a minute. Uh, but I'm sure, as you know, most founders get really excited about their companies. But uh, my my background is actually not in dentistry. Uh, I got into dentistry because of my partnership with the other co-founder, uh, Rodney Hanoon, who was actually, um, he built a company called Glove, uh, Glove Club, if if you remember, and um, they got bought by Shine. So um, him and I are friends that, going back to, to high school, very close friends. Um, and uh, what got me into dentistry is I was in clean tech, actually. So I was actually working with companies that were recycling plastics back into fuel, 
um, uh, battery company, companies and things like that. So I'm, I'm an engineer by background. So I've always been interested in healthcare, um, wanted to make an impact. And so we got together and he told me about dentistry and uh, the partnership was like, well, look, you know, uh, can we do something different in dentistry? Can we take your skills, your experience to bringing value of products to, to the customers? But can we really make our own path and, and, and try to see if we can make, um, if, if the environment is an angle there and, and um, take it from there? And so that's how we started. And the journey has been uh, quite nonlinear. I would say that um, the first few years, we really pushed hard on the eco and got beat up, got beat up hard because um, it was at a time also that, you know, 12 years ago, uh, uh, maybe it's a political thing, maybe it's a, but it, it was not very well received. Um, a lot of doubts. And so that got us to actually spend a lot more time being very precise on where we are eco-friendly. So instead of just having a big label, we would go back and say, well, well here's what we are doing. Here are the products that are eco-friendly. Here are the products will make a bit of an impact. Here's where, you know what, it's not a big deal, but sure, I'll, I'll let you know. And then we, we got really heavy into everything that is um, waste related because dentistry is small in terms of your impact on the environment. But you take something like mercury, which I know is controversial, but the EPA has uh, talked about how 50% of the mercury in the waters comes from dentistry. We thought, well, wow, that's a that's an easy problem to solve. You know, I can I can um, uh, work on that. And so we developed our own system actually with a partner in Europe, and and um, and we came up with an amalgam separator, and we gave it pretty much at cost to 10,000 dental practices. We made zero profit. In fact, we lost money on it the first five years. And that's sort of the things that we did for the environment. Um, today, we, with scale, we we have. Uh, um, uh, gloves that are running on biofuels. We have uh, uh, surfaces infectants that we brought into market um, that have no chemicals registered with EPA and have been rated as significantly better than cavicide. So, um, you know, and a lot more to go, but I think uh, we, we are on a good path. And interestingly enough, in the last few years, dentists are coming to us not just about a product and a price, but many are coming and, and telling us, well, you know, what do you have that's eco-friendly? Let's talk right. about that. And so, um, yeah, it's changing for sure. Well, you know, the thing is, is that the, the great fit here is because you are offering our members a great discount, um, it, it seems like a no-brainer if you can get it less expensive and it's more environmentally friendly. I, I, to me, it's really a no-brainer. And maybe the world is changing a little bit there. Um, you know, personally, I've, I've never been a, a, what I like to call a tree hugger, but I love right, right. camping. I love hiking. I love fishing. You know, I want to conserve what we have. And I think a lot of us are in that same boat where we are more conservationists rather than environmental activists. But I mean, let's face it, if you can save money on something and it's better for the environment, for me in my book, it's a no brainer. And, and this is where it's so uh, crucial. I benefited so much from my partnership with um, the, uh, my other co-founder who lives and breathes dental, because I understood from the from the beginning that um, this is not an excuse to have higher prices. You cannot afford right. to, have, you know, uh, dentists run a business and and uh, saving money is very crucial to to the bottom line. It, it, it's it's um, you know there's, this is non negotiable. So we not only just absorbed all of the extra expenses of being eco-friendly, but we looked for ways to be eco-friendly with minimal cost. And that's why it's an evolving uh, situation. Or we say we are uh, a dental company first that is trying to be as eco-friendly as we can, uh, subject to A, cost, and B, our ability to provide products that are as effective or more effective. Um, we got into, I don't want to say fights with feuds with other eco-friendly companies out there that were tree huggers by definition and saying, hey, look, you know, you can't, uh, you can't use a disposable for this, you know, use a cloth. And the argument was like, well, is that the best thing for infection control? Because we, we had a discussion about this. Remember, I told you when I first yeah. opened my practice, I got the, I got the little cloths because I wanted to be environmentally friendly. Those things looked so nasty after a few cycles in the sterilizer. I would yeah. never put that near a patient. Exactly. And, and so as a company, from a marketing standpoint, from a, from a messaging is very important to 
make sure that it's that it's understood that we are dentistry first. We're going to help you become eco eco friendly uh, at no cost to you. And by the way, you may not care, but your patients will care. So right. we'll help you communicate to your patients that um, you are making an impact. And, and if and not, if not all of them, then at least that's a market niche that you can tap into and exactly. advertise to that you don't currently. That's right. That's right. So, so talk to me a little bit about the um, the disinfecting solutions. Would that be hypochlorous acid? No, no. Actually, so the what did you guys bring the, to board? Pardon me. Uh, what, what did you guys bring to board then? Uh, so when we started off, we got some feedback from hygienists telling us, "Hey, you know, it's great you're doing all this, but can you come up with an eco friendly surface inspector? Can you find one? Because we're breathing in all these fumes, uh, hygienists and 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 assistants." Um, and, you know, it's really not that good, right? So what can you find out? So we came in very, very naively and said, well, you know, let's look into it. And we brought a lot of products um, uh, to Tufts University for a double blind uh, study. We looked at um, uh, products that came from Europe that were not available here, products that came from Canada, and a lot of the um, sort of the gimmicky products, uh, silver nanoparticles, whatnot, you know, and see. And our, our aim was, hey, if we can find something that's okay, um, that's good. And if we find nothing, well, that's okay. We've done some, we've done some homework. Maybe we can share it. That's part of our, of our, of our um, you know, mission to, to try to find out the truth. From that study, a lot of the eco-friendly, supposedly eco-friendly products came up to be complete you know, nonsense. Right. One really stood out. Um, that's, that one's called Biosurf. And it really stood out. And... Um, uh, actually killed things that cavicide didn't kill. And it had zero chem uh, chemicals registered with EPA. It's, uh, it's uh, you know, alcohol-based, but it essentially denatures the, uh, um, um, uh, the, uh, the walls, the bacteria itself. And so, okay, we went along with that. We started uh, marketing it, uh, uh, selling it, and so on. Um, and then we, we uh, actually uh, decided that this product itself, we didn't want it to limit it by pure life. So we actually transferred it to another company that we actually also uh, have, which is a, um, a pure way, which is, which is a company focused on waste. So that's another subdivision and pure way sells to our competitors, pure way sells to, to Banco, to shine, to Patterson. And so we made that product available to all the other dealers. And in the last few years, it was picked up by Gordon Christensen, and um, he qualified it as the only truly effective surf surface disinfectant in dental, uh, saying it, uh, according to his studies, you know, killed, was a thousand times more effective than capsaicin, for example. That's, that's pretty fantastic. Can you so, do me a favor? Can you yeah. get me a, a copy of that article, and I will gladly post it on TBOD? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Fantastic. So you brought you. you brought something up a couple of times here, and I was looking for a great segue into it, and that is the waste disposal. Now, we hadn't talked about that before. Do you guys handle biological wastes from dental practices, and do you handle sharps? We handle sharps. We handle biological waste. And what we, we, uh, we in fact, through our sister company, um, have uh, over 100,000 customers uh, that are dental, medical, vet, and uh, we have um, a lot of the pharmaceutical drugs uh, today are being sent with our systems. Excellent. So, so. I'm, um, I'm curious, what does that type of contract look like with you? There, there's a, a well-known uh, company that I'm not going to mention their name because I'm not going to slander them. Yeah. Uh, but most, most of us know exactly who I'm talking about. And they, they price gouge and they fix you into multi-year contracts that auto renew. Talk to us a little bit about what you do there, because I know that personally you could help out a whole lot of the dentists in this group uh, just, you know, with a bit more fair practices. Yeah. Um, we, uh, we don't have contracts um, uh, in place. So there's two types of ways that we can take care of waste. Um, you've got your pick your pickups and you've got your uh, mailbacks. Uh, mailbacks can be significantly cheaper because um, than pickup because they aren't as needed. So a typically a contract is going to force you into a monthly type of pickup situation. But depending on what your jurisdiction is, you may not need monthly. Sometimes it's, you know, Yearly is completely fine. Sometimes it says, hey, you know, you have, must pick it up when it smells. It really depends on, on, on where you're at. Um, so 
mailback can so mailback is no obligation at all and then if you are a big producer of waste which typically you know then dental offices are not um then pickup is probably going to be um a cheaper because you need to have a much higher frequency in which case um you know we'll, we can do contract or no contract at the convenience of the uh, of the office but most of our business is non-contract and it's uh, as as needed and in fact part of what we do is we advise you as to the frequency you need that based on the regulation so it's not just about saving you the money on, on the, the, the container it's, it's saying hey you're doing it every month you don't need to do it every month you can do it every six months um the waste systems uh we actually uh, manufacture everything soup to nuts um uh, through our sister company so um there's just not possible to get a better price than than, than you would get through us fantastic well you Guys out there, you heard them. By the way, folks, um, since we are live in the business of dentistry right now, if you do have a question for our guest, just go ahead and drop it into the chat, and I will ask him whenever it's an appropriate time. Uh, so you mentioned that you guys have the manufacturing of a lot of this stuff. Uh, that's interesting because most places actually get everything manufactured by one or maybe three different manufacturers, and it's all relabeled and shipped out. Are you guys yeah. one of the three or are you guys, you own just a smaller, uh, smaller factory? For the waste, you mean? Right. Um, we don't private. Well, actually, that's not true. Um, we do private label for some companies. Um, and the one that I think you were not going to mention uh, is probably private labeling some of the systems that we do. Yeah. Um, uh, for that, and category. you know exactly who I'm talking about too. It's it's funny that anyone signs up with them because they have such I've, a bad reputation. I, I've got I've got an idea. Yes, I've got a good idea. <laughs> so, uh, but yes, there's very few people in that space, and the reason why we um, started doing the manufacturing, and actually we we've also built the software soup to nuts to be able to track everything that's going on, um, is because we started reselling it right. So Pure Life initially. We wanted to tackle on waste because, well, how are you going to be eco-friendly? What can you do, right? I mean, there's not 10,000 things you can do. I'm not going to tell you to bike to work. I'm not going to tell you to recycle more paper. That's meaningless for dental, right? What What is dental specific? And so we started reselling and we realized how big one is. There's so many layers. And if anything goes wrong, uh, and waste is a serious issue. There's liabilities. We have doctors calling us and something goes wrong. You cannot find anyone down the chain from the recycler to the intermediary who's gonna who who wants to take the blame is willing to fix right. it to help the customers. Meanwhile, the customer is holding a bucket of sharps or a bucket of uh, amalgam or an amalgam separator that's dripping, and they're going nuts and they are pissed at everybody. Right? It's not our fault, but they, we sold it to them. So then we realize, look, this cannot go through multiple channel. It has to be all into one, and we have to we have to uh, integrated vertically to cut out the cost, but more importantly, to have a, 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 a very transparent system of, of tracking and, 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 um, and something that protects liability wise. Great answer. So talk to me, um, so far as your manufacturing goes, I know that a lot of people will make claims about recycled materials and this, that, and the other, and they'll say, oh, it's hundred percent recycled, but they don't tell you that it's recycled from the blanks that they punched out parts from and it's no post-consumer waste. Right. How much of your stuff is post-consumer waste? And if it's not, how much have you saved going to the landfills by using what you are using? So I can't, I don't know how much we've saved on the landfill. Um, uh, I don't know that for a fact. In terms of the, the recycled part, it's one of the smallest thing we do. Um, um, and it's, I would say, depending on the product, sometimes it's 50%, sometimes it's, and we usually don't try to talk about it unless it's at least 40% because right. that's meaningless. Uh, sometimes it's a hundred percent. Um, I think the, the biggest thing that we do is, uh, for, uh, from a traditional recycling standpoint is, is there's, there's many products that have plastics. And so we'll use, um, bioplastics for it. In our waste, for example, um, everything is bioplastic. And the, the, the shredding part is uh, the shredding machine that we have in, in our facility shreds the waste and then sells it off to a company that takes it and then puts it back into the industry and making different kinds of 
plastic parts. I don't know what Very they cool. use it for, but uh, cars and so on. And we don't, don't have that for all the products, right? Let's be honest. So we try to mention where it is. Um, we have a hundred percent offset of, of, of everything that we do from the beginning. So essentially we, we get, uh, from UPS, um, all of the, um, uh, shipping, uh, um, uh, of the products to us and then to the customer. And then there's a, um, an emission calculation, right? It's an emission, you know, how much CO2 we put in the air because of all the shipping. Um, and we work with a, a firm called carbon fund and they tell us basically how many trees are needed to offset that and how much, what check we need to write to them to offset it. And so um, over the last uh, 10 years, we've, we've uh, through Carbon Fund, uh, planted the equivalent of 300,000 plus trees. So yeah, it's not, it's not crazy. It's not a lot. I mean, it's not millions, but it's something. So right. you combine that with, you know, some of the preferential chemistries we have with uh, the fact that we're not going to put our name on, on, uh, on just any product. It's, it's smaller steps towards uh, hopefully a, a, a better solution. So let's talk a little bit about the products that you offer and the discounts that you're offering this group. Um, first, the products that you offer and, and what can't they get? I mean, let's, let's get that argument out of the way of yeah. what you guys don't carry first. And then let's talk a little bit about what you do. Okay. So we don't carry heavy equipment. So CAD cam, uh, systems, chairs, we don't carry it. Um, the one of the, there's two reasons why we don't carry CAD CAM. Well, number one is it's kind of a closed circle. So um, unless you're Shine, Patterson, Banco, it's quite difficult to get your hands on those. Uh, two, I don't think we're very good, would be very good at doing it right now. So we're not set up for that. So we wouldn't want to actually sell just to sell. We like to be experts in the products we, we provide. We like to advise our doctors, um, you know, Hey, you should, you know, for your application, this GC product is great. For this, the other one, use the 3M one. It goes faster or so on. So um, no heavy equipment. Everything else we have. So all the merchandise we have, we have all the major brands authorized for all the major brands, uh, you know, 20,000 plus SKUs. And um, we have never, uh, ever uh, done um, gray markets. So everything we sell is original from the manufacturer. We don't do gray market. And I think it's an important part, uh, you know, point to, to, to mention because I think most of our competitors do. Even the big guys, they sort of blend gray with non-gray to improve margins. One, and, one of uh, them got caught doing it. Um, actually, it, was, it blew up really big on the group. I think it was three years ago. Um, one of the big two, I'll say. Big two. Okay. Um, a doctor had ordered something. It came in. And I, I don't remember exactly the story. It was expired or something. And so he called them up and the supply chain knew nothing about it. They claimed that that serial number of that product, you know, it came from the rep. Now the story is, oh, the rep got fired because he was evidently selling it out of the back of his truck or something and then collecting the money. How likely do you think that is? Cause I, I don't, I smell something fishy about that story. Hey guys, this is Doc Huffpower, founder of the Business of Dentistry and host of the Dear Doc podcast. Today, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about one of our sponsors. 4G Dental Labs has been a sponsor of the Business of Dentistry for over two years now. They're a family-owned business located here in Houston, Texas. They're fast, they're reliable, but best of all, they provide affordable quality. They're just plain, honest, good people. For our TVOD members, for your first 20 crowns, every fifth one will be free. Contact 4G Dental Labs at 833-682-8901. Again, that's 833-682-8901. Or you can mail or even just stop by. Jeff Guidi, the owner, would be glad to see you. I don't know about the details exactly, but there's a lot of, there's a lot of, funny stuff like that happening um usually it's uh so the gray market first of all is 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 industry-wide and it is part of the corporate strategy to blend it in but crazy little things usually don't happen at the corporate level they'll happen at the rep level and i'll give you an example you asked me about my journey um it is uh it's very tough for smaller dealers to make their way up and get access to brands because um, the big guys 
are very focused on keeping it a very closed circle to make right. sure. And they, and they will threaten people. I've been involved in this side of things before. Correct. They will they threaten, threaten companies. Hey, we're just not going to carry your product anymore. Exactly. If you let these guys sell it. So, and one of the reasons why we got access to all the brands in the first six years, because it's unseen before, is because we actually brought differentiation to these brands in terms of how we position them, the markets we brought them to, we, we give them access to a differentiated market, a more eco-friendly and socially responsible market. And so they could justify to them to themselves that they, they, they could add us. But yes, they got a lot of phone calls. And uh, the first, the second year of Pure Life's existence, uh, funny story, we got a raid by the pharmacy board but we didn't, weren't selling any pharmacy, any pharmaceuticals by then. There, there was nothing. We did, basically, somebody called saying we were selling illegal narcotics. So they stormed our warehouse. Everybody was freaked out. And, and, uh, and then it, was, it ended up being a joke. We said, look, you know, we don't sell pharmaceuticals. What are you talking about? When we um, added 3M to our line, uh, 3M got co called us because they said they're getting reports that we're selling gray market. I said, well, we haven't even added your product to the catalog yet. We just added you guys. We haven't sold a product yet. Who are you getting these calls from? So it, it's a very, it's a, it, there's a lot of that, right? And I think you just got to ignore it and just focus on, you know, focus on the ball ahead, right? But yes, it, it's, it's very, it's funny. It's funny that it gets to that point. You guys have been open for 12 years now. You've had some fights on your hands, fighting the big guys. Just like the dentists out there who are fighting to save money. So talk to us a little bit about what it is that you guys are going to do for yeah. our membership and, um, and what they have to do to get that. And then if you wouldn't mind, I want you to go ahead and take over the screen. I want you to show us what the buying experience looks like, if you can. Okay. Go to, go to the website. And, um, and then we will reiterate what the offer is. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right. Fantastic. Perfect. Um, okay. So first of all, I'll say that um, we actually have quite a lot of respect, not for every sing single company out there, but many of the big guys. So it's competitive, but um, you know, a lot of great companies. Uh, there's a place for the big two, the big three. We totally understand the value proposition and um and respect it. So um, the, the question is, well, how do we how do we deserve? How do we make ourselves um, uh, worthy of getting the business of a dentist? Because uh, you know, if it's just about price, then anybody else can do it, right? So we need a better uh, reason for that. We, you know, we always tell the reps, you know, um, when a customer orders from us, there needs to be a reason to order from Pure Life, and then there needs to be there needs to be a reason to order from you, the rep. Don't think that you are owed that business. So um, long story short, our niche, aside from the fact that we are um, uh, more environmentally friendly and, and socially responsible, we're offering great prices to your group. We can do this um, for uh, two reasons. One is from, from a technology standpoint, we've streamlined a lot of our processes and systems that we can actually have a lot of efficiency that we can pass on. Um, I'll cover that. What that means is, um, for every transaction that happens, we have a lot fewer people um, working to make it happen from distribution to order taking to, to free goods. Um, we, all these things are fully automated. So you order products with us, whether it's online or offline. You know how all these manufacturers have these very complicated free goods de deals. Buy three, get one free. But if it's this, do that. And if it's that, we codify everything in code in computer code and all these communications get automated on our back end, whether it's coming from the website or from a, from a rep. So uh, your customers, sorry, your doctors can get uh, the free goods they deserve. They don't have to chase it. And for us, we redeem it automatically for them, but it doesn't cost us much time or money or anything like that. So that's how we can pass on the savings. Um, what we do for your members is a formulary type of situation where we've pre-negotiated great pricing and that's across the board. We can be much more effective on our own products, obviously the, the disposables, the gloves and things like that, but even with the brands. 
And uh, that formulary pricing is baked into not just our website, but also um, our ERP system. So when your members call in um, and they're registered um, as a member, then we recognize them right away. They don't have to haggle. They don't have to say anything. Um, the rep will see that pricing pop up right away. And if they're online, they will see uh, that price uh, pop up as well. We have uh, probably the best rewards program. Actually, probably. I'm almost sure of it, but I don't like to, uh, you know, you never know. But we have a fantastic rewards program. Um, you get uh, points on every single purchase all the time. And um, we have plenty of email and flyer offers that do 5x points, 10x points, 20x points. What this translates is in pretty much the equivalent of 5 to sometimes 10% cash back on everything you do in a form of points. And then you can go online and anytime you want, accumulate these points and um, pick from about 100 retailers that you want a gift card from or just a Visa gift card and redeem that. Save it for yourself, give it to staff. Um, and so, so, so guys, real quick, I have to interject something here. You guys realize that any kind of a rebate or refund from a company is completely 100% tax free. Just putting that out there. Tax free money, man. Love it. Tax free money. Um, uh, especially these days, right? So, um, we do have uh, free shipping for your group as well. Um, so I guess the summary is probably very good pricing, the best quality, no compromise, never gray. Uh, we are, uh, we have uh, distribution in the East coast and the West coast. So we'll probably get to you within one to two days, anywhere in the U S except for Texas. I'm sorry. You're in the middle and you know, <laughs> not quite ready for a third DC yet. That, that's it. No discounts that's for anyone. Okay. Anymore. okay. All right. We'll get talking to you. <laughs> um, and then we have a lot of automation tools that um, that we provide that hopefully are helpful. Um, I'll start let's, with- Let's go ahead and talk. I was yeah. going to say, let's talk about yeah. those because I found those fascinating. So let me start with the, the newest one and the one that's uh, gaining the, the most traction and fastest. Uh, and that's our authorship program. So we have an authorship program that you can set up online or offline. You tell us any, any product that you want that you order regularly. Uh, currently offline could be anything online right now. We're limiting it to a few products just because we didn't think it was going to be that popular, but we're limiting to gloves and disposables, but soon we'll have everything online too. Um, and you said the frequencies, you can tell us, you know, I want bibs, uh, once a week, one case, I want, uh, this SKU of gloves once a month. I want this other SKU of gloves every two months. I want the surfaces disinfectant every six months. You can make it as complicated as you want, set and forget it. And it's done. Uh, what that gets you is not just your pricing, but you save another 5% on top of your pricing. Why? Because we want you to do that, right? We, it helps you know, keep the, the, the relationship uh, moving. But the beauty of it is there's no, there's absolutely no, um, there's no contract. There's no, you can go in, call us anytime, cancel it, do it, go online, cancel it, change it, say, you know, I want this product pushed out. And, and we, so we build it for dentistry. We built, this is a, a tool that we built 100% ourselves for dentistry. Because even if you were to look at software out there that does auto shipments or subscriptions, they're not meant for dentistry. They're meant for, okay, I want my basket of bread every month. But how, how do dentists work? Once a week, twice a week, here and there, calling every two weeks and change it. Oh, I don't want this. I want to push it out. I want to bring it in. I want to. And so it's got all that flexibility. Um, and that's, we, we've pretty much in the last three months, enrolled 10% of our customers on that, which is crazy because I thought that was going to take years to do that. Um, and, and the reviews are great. So not only do you get, you save 5% on top of your pricing and it's fully automated, you don't have to worry about it, but as prices go down, it'll adjust with you, right? And so this is more important because glove prices are still kind of trending down now with the supply chain uh, issues. So if you set up an auto ship for a certain price, and we lower the price, say, in two weeks, it'll get adjusted down automatically. You don't have to that, call back. That's amazing. You don't have to worry about getting locked into some subscription model. Exactly. Exactly. And it adjusts exactly with the, with the cost. So that's been super popular. Um, and, 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 and some dentists like the savings, but most dentists like the, the convenience. Um, 
we have a, uh, a, a smart restock tool. Smart restock, basically, we, we um, go through all of your purchases and on a monthly basis, we'll, we'll send you what we think you need. So it's kind of an inventory management tool. And then you can click on it and it fills up a, a cart for you already. And you can select what you like from it, everything or a few things. You can call it in, you can, you can email it, or you could just click online and, and get it done. Um, that is obviously as useful as, as, as you are ordering from us. So if you order a lot of stuff from, from Pure Life, then that will be pretty much your inventory management tool. If you order one or two items, maybe less useful. Um, we have another one that I want to mention, and that's the um, Pure Deals. So uh, a lot of the reps out there have pocket deals, right? So you've got your quarterly specials, for example, but what happens is in reality is, you know, your sales rep, John, may have a special deal for uh, um, your city because he's trying to make quota. So uh, uh, he's, he's willing to work out this amazing deal um, just for, for, you know, that city or his geography that particular month because of a quota issue, or maybe because you buy 3M products um, and is a GC rep, he's willing to throw out something that's much more aggressive than is even published. So all of these kind of pocket deals, we translate into rules and we load into our system. So when you log in, uh, basically, we know what you do, we know who you are, we know what you purchase, we link that up with what we know our manufacturers are willing to do, and we serve up these deals. And sometimes they're at cost, right? Because what happens is that they're at cost for us, but a manufacturer is giving us a kickback afterwards because that was a highly valuable deal for them because we got a, we got a 3M um, um, manufacturer, a GC, uh, a GC customer, right? So it's we're trying to automate and replicate the best possible rep experience. And that is a rep that's going to go to bat for you and calling the manufacturers and making these things happen, which doesn't always happen, as you know. Absolutely. So, so, those are three examples. so real quick, just to make sure everyone knows, is, is there any kind of sign up fee for this? Um, you think there should be? There's not. There's not. That's the point. There's Guys, no, there, look. There, there's okay. no sign up fee. There's no sign up fee. I'm just it's joking. It's free to sign up to find out if you can save money. And it sounds like you're going to get some of the best deals around with some of these, you know, pocket deals. That sounds pretty darn amazing to me. Um, I think if you don't sign up for this, you're being very foolish. Absolutely. And in fact, you know what, uh, go online and click on pure deals and, and check them out for yourselves. Um, yeah, you'll see. And, and, um, uh, I think you'll be blown away. They are, they are, they are crazy. Some of them are pretty crazy deals. Well, we, we do have a relationship with another crazy dental people. Uh, yes. I didn't mean like crazy as in trademark crazy, crazy as in the English word crazy. Yes. Absolutely. Insane. These prices it's, are insane. It's, 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 it's ludicrous. Ludicrous. There you yeah. go. There you go. All right. So um, why don't you go ahead? I, I've actually just posted the, um, I've just posted the deal that we talked about and um, your number and all that kind of stuff on the top of this this interview. So if anybody's looking for that, you just look right up top. We just posted that there. But Omar, if you don't mind, can you go ahead and take over real quick? And um, I'll let you just give Absolutely. us uh, the, the the five second tour of the of the website. Yeah, five second tour. And I'm sure because uh, I'm going to demo it live, uh, nothing's going to work. But let's see. <laughs> Isn't that always the way? It always happens. Like, uh, can you see my screen? I can. Okay. So this is a test account. Uh, so, uh, you know, ignore uh, uh, the, the numbers here, but you'll see right now when you log in, you see your savings. Now this, this is a test account, didn't do much. Uh, points uh, for our peer awards, trees we've planted for that account, so one. So you get right away kind of a, a differentiation. These are the tools that are different from us, uh, pure deals, pure awards, and ownership. So um, I will just basically, um, you can click on pure deals, for example, Let's see, right. And you will see, um, um, hold on one second, just go back. Yeah. So every pure deal, um, item will have this kind of, um, uh, icon 
and, and you'll be able to uh, recognize it. So you can browse any item in there um, and you'll see the icon. Um, let's see if I click on, um, let me go on pure rewards. I don't know if this test account has, so pure rewards, there you go. this test account has some points. Um, so this is an example of what you can do. You can, how you earn your points based on how much you spend. You can earn one X, two X, three X, four X. Once you've accumulated a bunch of points and here, this is a starter account that has to, oh, I should mention when you sign up to Pure Life, you're going to get 2000 points, which is a $10 gift card period. So we give you a $10 gift card into your account. So this is a, an account that hasn't spent any. So now wait a minute. You see, you, you were wrong earlier. There is a fee to sign up, but you pay it. <laughs> yeah, it's my fee. Yeah, I'm paying it. Exactly. So you can, you can check your, your points and we'll send you emails on your balance, et cetera. Um, and if you, by the way, spend a lot, we upgrade you automatically. You don't have to ask for it. And then you go to earn points, for example. So, um, well, yeah, redeem pure points. And then you have all these gift cards and you can essentially select what you want by category and it'll get emailed to you within 24 hours and you can spend it right away. It's all e gift cards. So that's one of the rewards. Um, I probably should look at, uh, you have a product you want to look at or, you know, a category. Let's look at. Yeah, um, I'd actually like to see some of the small equipment that you guys do carrying. Okay. So let's pick on small equipment right here. So that gives you an idea of the small yeah. equipment that we have. We have the special. So let's say, for example, this one is a two plus one. So view product. Right. And I'm going to add two. I'm going to add four. See what happens. I added four and it's two plus one. So it tells me I got to select two of them. So I can select one and one, or I can select one and two, and it's done. So it does all the intelligence for you, right? Um, now, this is an easy one, but sometimes you have very complicated free goods products. Once you add a free good here, it shows up on your invoice. Sometimes the manufacturer wants it, but also it goes into our system and we email uh, or fax or the manufacturer directly, depending on what they want. So all, all gets this all gets taken care of on the back end by us. Fantastic. Okay. So a question, a quick question for you: Is there anywhere that they can go on your website just to say what are the free goods deals this month or this week? Uh, yes, and I'll show you this in a second. I'm now going to AutoShip, the AutoShip portal. As I mentioned, the AutoShip portal has is limited to, uh, so I'm gonna look, look to new AutoShips here, for example. It is limited to gloves and a few disposables online, um, but offline, you can order anything you want, right? So here, for example, um, I wanna add um, a glove. So I can select, I want two of this quantity every month, but I want, uh, one of this one quarterly, and I want one of these weekly. I add it and it's done. That's my auto ship. And then once I'm done with my auto ship, that was an auto ship that was previously created. I can edit it. I can add the address. I can change the address. Actually, I can edit it here and I can go back and say, you know, I actually don't want 10 anymore. I want nine or I'm going to keep the 10, but I want the next ship date to be, I'm going to push it out a few days, right? So it's a very, very simple way, very kind of dental focused uh, way of um, um, scheduling what you want, um, whenever you want, um, having the discounts for it and, and not having to worry about it. You also get email notifications one week before it ships out. So reminding you that it's out. <laughs> just in case you still have, you know, six boxes left for some reason. Uh, yeah. Or, you know, sometimes people set up, uh, they get really busy and they set up a bunch of auto ships and, and, and um, you know, they, they just, they just want to know that they're going to be reminded, right? Because, you know, nobody likes to have ongoing shipments like that. So it's just, you know, we give them all the touch points so they never have to worry about it um, at all. So that's the auto ship program. It's uh, um, again, working out really, really well. Um, if you wanted to look at the, uh, what's on, oh, uh, we have a quarterly special here somewhere. Uh, forget what it is. There we go. All the quarterly specials are here. So if I click on the quarterly specials, 
you will see everything that has kind of a buy get or a special price or something Fantastic. like that. Fantastic. Yeah. But we but they're mentioned if you you browse anything uh, in our catalog and we'll pick oh, there's there's one right there on the front page. Right. There, exactly. So those are popular products, but um, uh, see, we'll go to Andodontic. I don't know if there's any specials there. But if there is one, it'll show up. Right. Excellent. So you don't have to know. We don't have to search for it. We always give it to you. If for whatever reason, uh, of course, your pricing comes with the, whatever special the manufacturer gives in. And if for whatever reason, um, there's a promotion out there that is better. And it usually by design, it doesn't happen, but you never know. Humans can make errors. Um, the system will always give you the best price. So it's always defaulting to give you the best price uh, uh, on, on whatever whatever is going on out there. Fantastic. All right. Well, guys, you've seen a little bit. We're not going to go too much deeper into the weeds on the uh, on on the website because half our doctors have just gotten off of work and they're going to fall asleep. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I, and I would say, look, website or no website, uh, you'll get white glove service here. Um, we're not pushing anybody on the web that doesn't want to be on the web. It's a tool. You can use it. You can use it with a with a rep, without a rep. We'll have dedicated reps for you. Um, so um, it's it's you shouldn't have to sacrifice anything. It's 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 really about um, giving you the most uh, advanced possible experience uh, you can have with uh, with all the hand holding you need. And uh, the Midwest high speed hand piece deal with the five percent cash back on pure wards and the three plus three has that ended yet, or does that end tomorrow? You know what. You're asking the wrong person. I don't think it's ended. It should probably okay. end tomorrow, uh, but uh, I, I should know that. I'm sorry. No, no, that's all right. I mean, you, you don't know every single one. Of I don't them. know every single promotion <laughs> at any given time. But now you it, see, Omar, very... if you had if you had a button that showed you all of these goods, I know. <laughs> you know what? Um, I have never heard of a promotion ending on a on a on a Thursday. So it's either ending tomorrow or or um, it'll be extended. But fantastic. We can... Well, guys. Go on over to purelifedental.com or just click the link above us and sign up because not only is it free, you're going to get 10 bucks to do it. I mean, heck, have your team sign you up. I'm sure they want the $10. They'll bring it to Starbucks, so, which, which I did notice was one of the, uh, you, you guys, yes. you guys know yeah. as well, Starbucks, right? So all you have to do is click the link and sign up. Now, uh, Pure Life is a new sponsor to the business of dentistry. And um, they help us to do what we do for you, help us to make life a little bit easier for you and to supply an area where we can have civil discourse about business decisions and, um, and leading your team. So go ahead and give them a try. Omar, thank you so much for coming on this evening. And thank, thank you, you for, for giving me your time. Me your time. Uh, guys, right. thank you again for joining us here on the Deer, Bo Deer Doc podcast. And um, we hope to see you again soon. Thank you for your support. Bye-bye. Thanks for listening to the Dear Doc Podcast, your source for the business and legal questions associated with your dental practice. Don't forget to subscribe to the Dear Doc Podcast on all major platforms.